What are boogers? I know, I know, they are my friends. Oh, um, some. In order to understand boogers, we need to first learn about mucus. Mucus is huh? the slimy, sticky substance which is produced by tissues in our nose, mouth, sinuses, throat, as well as our digestive tract. Hmm. Mucus helps catch harmful viruses, dirt, germs, and pollen, and thus protects our lungs. Hmm. Tiny hairs inside our nose called cilia move the mucus along with the trapped stuff towards the front of our nose. Now when we sneeze or blow our nose, the mucus comes out. If some mucus along with the debris remains in the nose, then it starts to dry out and clumps together and finally becomes a booger. Hmm. How do we puke? Simple, like this. Oh, um, some. Puking or vomiting is generally controlled by a part of the brain called area postrema. Now, when it instructs our stomach to purge, several things happen in our body. Firstly, huh? our teeth get coated with excess saliva to protect them from stomach acid. Our heart rate and breathing increases as we retch. Finally, the stomach and other abdominal muscles forcefully push the contents upwards and we puke. Hmm. Why are we huh? afraid of the dark? <laughs> Om Sum is not afraid of anyone. Huh? Oh, Om Sum! In prehistoric times, especially at night, our ancestors were at high risk of being attacked by predators or enemies. Hence, through evolution, the tendency to fear darkness developed in us. Also, as we cannot see properly in the dark, we become anxious and start to imagine the worst possible outcomes. Hence, we are afraid of the dark. Hmm. Does it rain diamonds on Jupiter and Saturn? Yippee! Omsum is all set to go to Jupiter and Saturn. Oh, Omsum. Scientists believe that it can actually rain diamonds on Jupiter and Saturn. Hmm. These planets have methane-rich atmospheres. During storms, lightning turns methane present in clouds into soot. As soot begins to fall, it is subjected to intense temperatures and pressures. These conditions squeeze the soot huh? into chunks of graphite. As the pressure increases, graphite is compressed, making it literally rain diamonds. Hmm. Does an octopus huh? have nine brains? Nah, only Amsum has nine brains. Oh, Amsum. An octopus has a decentralized nervous system, with majority of its neurons residing in its arms. These neurons help the arms to independently taste, touch, and control basic motions without consulting the actual brain in its head. Thus, it gives an impression of having nine brains, when in reality, it only has one. Hmm. What is sleep huh? paralysis? No big deal. Omsum is always in a sleep paralysis. Oh, Omsum. Sleep paralysis usually occurs when we are dreaming in a REM sleep, as in rapid eye movement sleep. Researchers suggest that when we enter REM sleep, two chemicals, as in GABA and glycine, switch off the activity of our cells. This is done to stop us from enacting our dreams and getting hurt. Now, if we suddenly wake up during the REM sleep, but if GABA and glycine are still active, then even though we are conscious, we are temporarily unable to move. This is called as sleep paralysis. Hmm. Why do humans love music? Simple, because Omsum makes great music. Oh, Omsum. When sound vibrations are produced in specific and intricate patterns, it is known as music. Some researchers found out that we love music because of a neurotransmitter called dopamine. For example, when we eat tasty food, the reward system in our brain is activated and dopamine is released. Dopamine basically makes us feel good. Similarly, when we listen to music, the same dopamine is released, thus making us love listening to music. Hmm. Why do we dream? We don't dream. Our brain dreams. Oh, awesome. One theory suggests that we dream to fulfill our wishes. It states that we are not able to express all our thoughts consciously. Hence, some of them find their way via dreams. Another theory called threat stimulation suggests that dreams are basically a defense mechanism. For example, nightmares put us in threatening situations, thus allowing us to practice our fight-or-flight response. 
Some people also believe that dreams don't huh? really mean anything. Hmm. Why do astronauts wear orange and white spacesuits? Simple. Because orange and white looks good in space. Oh, um, some. The orange spacesuit is called the Advanced Crew Escape Suit. This suit is worn during the launching or the landing of the space shuttle. If there is any malfunction during this period and the astronaut decides to escape, <laughs> then the orange color is the most visible against the blue sky and the sea. The white spacesuit is called the Extra Vehicular Activities Suit. This suit is worn when astronauts are working outside the space shuttle. Firstly, the white color reflects huh? most of the sun's extreme heat as compared to other colors. <laughs> also, it is easy to spot this color against the vast black expanse of space. Hmm. Why do our hands shake? Simple. Because we love to shake them. Oh, I'm some. When our hands shake, we are said to be experiencing hand tremors. Some problem with those areas of the brain which control movement huh? leads to tremors. We may experience hand tremors if we consume too much caffeine. We are suffering from lack of sleep or anxiety. We are suffering from a neurological disease such as Parkinson's. Hmm. How do mirrors work? Huh? Simple. There is someone behind them. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Firstly, visible light or sunlight is made up of seven different colors. A mirror consists of a glass surface in the front and behind it is an extremely smooth and thin metal film. Now, when light falls on the mirror, it passes through the glass surface and reaches the metal film. The metal film does not absorb any colors of light. Instead, it reflects back all of them. As a result, we can see ourselves in the mirror. Hmm. What are headaches? Huh? Omsum doesn't get headaches. There is no brain inside Omsum's head. Oh, Omsum. The pain that we sometimes experience in our upper neck or head is commonly called a headache. Headache is not an indication of our brain hurting. In fact, the brain does not have any pain receptors to experience pain. Headaches are commonly caused due to inflammation or overactivity of muscles, nerves, and blood vessels in our head or neck. Migraine is a common example of this type of headache. Mm. Why do we have huh? moles? Simple. Because Omsum likes them. Oh, um, some. Our skin has cells called melanocytes. They give our skin its color. However, sometimes huh? these cells tend to grow in clusters, thus forming moles. Moles can be present at birth or can appear later in life. They are usually black or brown and can be flat or raised. Some moles may even disappear with age. Huh? Mm. How can some people predict rain? Simple, by calling the clouds. Oh, um, some. Lightning usually occurs just before the beginning of heavy rainfall. Nitrogen and oxygen molecules which are present in the atmosphere are split by the lightning bolts. This eventually leads to the production of ozone. Now, strong blowing winds carry this ozone downward along with them. Ozone is a very sharp smelling gas. When a person smells this ozone, it helps him predict the rain. <laughs> hmm.